While we were camping at Flying Flags RV Resort and Campground, we decided to venture out and explore the town of Solving, which is about 20 minutes away from the campground. As we were walking around, we came across these cute little Jeep look-alike vehicles. They are actually called Moak Like Smoke. They are originally from Britain. The American Moak is all electric, street legal, and is a LSV, which stands for Low Speed Vehicle. It has a maximum speed of 25 miles per hour. Each one has a total of 10 batteries and you can charge it with a 110 outlet. Any household outlet will do. It takes 8 hours to get a full charge and as you can see they come in a variety of fun colors. We were a large group so we rented 5 of them for an hour and got 30 minutes for free for checking in on the Yelp app. There is no official office location. There was a desk set up right by the entrance to Big Bopper Drive-In. It's a burger joint on Mission Drive. This was our first time visiting Solvang, so armed with a map that was provided to us by the MOC staff, we headed out to explore this quaint little town. We explored Solvain and then decided to go off the beaten path and drove to the Alisar Guest Ranch and Resort and stopped to visit with the gorgeous horses on their property. And across from the ranch we also saw some cattle that you can see over on the right here. The horses on the property were very nice. They did let us pet them and they even came over to greet us when we got off of the moaks. And no solving visit is complete without getting some delicious danishes from one of the local bakeries. I definitely recommend the Moke experience. I had a great time exploring all over the city in these quiet little cars while my hair was blowing in the wind. After our Moke experience, we headed out to Ostrichland, USA in Buellton, where they have over 100 ostriches and emus on their property. These big birds are a rare and unique sight in this part of the world. Admission is $5 for those who are 12 or over and $2 for kids under the age of 12. When you enter, you can purchase a bowl of food for $1. Our kids had a great time here. We were probably here for about 45 minutes and unfortunately the gift shop was closed during our visit. But overall, it was a great visit. We all enjoyed it and it was pretty cool to get this close to these birds.
I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. Please do not forget to subscribe to my channel to join me on my DIY beauty, DIY home projects, travel, and money-saving adventures. Thanks again for watching and be well.